know we started already. Yeah. So today we're making ice cream cake. And today I think we have a special guest, right? Oh, you told him already. A special guest? We love ice cream and cake together. Today yeah. we're going to show you a very special ice cream cake that's super, super easy to make. So we do have a special guest today. And our special guest is Olivia Elliott. Come on in, Olivia. Hey, it's Olivia. Hello. Oh, Olivia's so tall. I don't know if she fits in the camera. We better switch places. Over here, Olivia. Oh. All right. There you go. That's her. Everybody's taller than me. I know. Oh, I saw your dad on there already. Hey. All right. So today we're making an ice cream cake. It's super easy. Mm -hmm. Super. And we're going to do it in just a few minutes, okay? Just a few minutes. Awesome. So we got some viewers there. All right, so we're going to show you the ingredients, okay? They're falling. Ooh, they're falling. It's the chocolate cake. All right, That's so. Not filled. Hold on. You need ice cream sandwiches. This is the regular box. You need Oreo cookies. Smash. You need chopped up cookies. Chocolate fudge, chocolate pudding, chocolate syrup, and chocolate syrup. Now, the chocolate syrup, that's optional. That's just in the end, okay? All right, so we're going to go ahead and start making our, our ice cream cake. So, RJ, if you could go on this side with Olivia. All right. So Olivia and RJ are going to help me out, and they're going to take all the wrappers off the ice cream. Okay? And I'm going to show you about chopping up the cookies first, okay? So, so sitting here unwrap them. you can put them on here after you wrap them, unwrap them. All right, so we're going to build our ice cream cake on this square, okay? This is a piece of wax paper. Now, you don't need the whole bag of Oreo cookies. You just need about, mm, I think about 16 or 17 cookies, okay? So some of your cookies are going to be, uh, <laughs> your dad said you wear a smile. I said, she might be a little shy for this. Um, so some of the cookies will be for the top of the cake and some of the cookies will be for the inside mixture, okay? So the ones for the inside mixture are gonna be chopped real fine. Hey! Um, they're going to be chopped really fine. And the ones for the top of the cake are going to just be crumbled, okay? Now, there's a couple ways you can crumble those cookies. You can do them in a food processor, which I recently got a nice one from my friend Brooke. Um, she blessed me with that for Christmas. Thank you, Brooke. Um, Shout out. She said, and there's Livia, too. <laughs> Troy's mom said. Oh, my gosh. I told you we have guest appearances here. So they are unwrapping the ice cream sandwiches. Super easy if you're just tuning in. Unwrap the sandwiches. And I'm going to get the cookies prepared, okay? So we can make the mixture, all right? They're going so fast, they're almost done. So before the show, I went ahead and just chopped up some cookies for the top. I don't know if you can see that, they're kind of chunky. It doesn't matter, just, chunk, uh, just chop them up. Uh, the ones for the inside though, you want them to be a little finer, okay? This was about six, seven cookies, okay? There's no set rule on how many. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do some cookies in the food processor. You guys still unwrapping? Now, if you guys don't know, Olivia and RJ have been friends since RJ was born. I've known Olivia since she was a little girl. And, um, RJ was born, of course, while I had still known her. She always took care of him. She was always helpful. They've always been friends. Oh, there's Miss Michelle. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Uh, <laughs> Hey, uh, so um, Olivia's always been around RJ. They have been like best buddies. We're going to show you a picture in a little bit about how they were growing up. So, so far I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Just put them in there. Eight, nine, ten. We'll do ten, okay? So we have ten Oreos in there. We're going to chop them up real good, okay? So Olivia, while we're doing this, you want to show them that picture on the phone of you and RJ? Oh, and you hold it up to that one side there. Right here. Yep. Hold it so they can see. That's them when they were little. She always took care of them. I'm sorry I'm being so loud. Yes, yeah, so loud. I have to yell. You have to yell. Like totes do. All right. So let's show you that. 
nice and fine. See it? All right. So we need our bowl. All right, so we're going to put these cookies in this bowl. Okay? And then we are going to put two scoops of fudge. Put a little spoon. All right. Maybe. It's a little stuck there. Big scoops, too. You can even do three. It's not really like a set amount. We're going to do three. We're, we wanted extra chocolate. All right. So, so far we have the cookies and the fudge in there, okay? okay. That was ten cookies. Don't forget. And then we have pudding. Oh, There's Jeannie. Jeannie. Oh, boy, she says. You guys are going to learn this cake, and everybody's going to be making this cake. Mm. All right. So. I'm going to put half a pack of the pudding mix, not the whole pack. You don't need a lot. About half of it, okay? Well, we're going to use our Cool Whip now. <gasps> cool Whip. Now, I got the big one. I like to get the bigger one because then you have a little more to decorate the top of the cake with. And then you don't have to worry about running out. You can do it with just the one small one. Uh, but you're a little bit uh, slim when it comes to the top of the cake, okay? So I got the bigger one. All right, so it's about three cups. We're going to do four just to be safe. Well, no, we're going to say three. Can I have that little scoop, Olivia? The purple one. All right, so there's one. That's a lot. It is a lot. Two? Just to be safe. Just to be safe. So we are doing three. Okay. All right. So that can go over there and stay to the side for now. So we're going to mix this up. Can you see it? All right. So we're mixing up our, this is going to be the topping to go on top of the ice cream sandwiches. What you guys could do, you could start for me, and you're going to put four sandwiches. So what we do then after we mix this all up, we start layering it. So four sandwiches. Stick them together in the middle. Oh, like stick them together? Yeah, in the middle. In the middle, in the middle of the thing. Up there, Olivia, where RJ has them. Like squish them together? Like well, that? kind of, yeah, on the sides. You need another one on there because it should be four. Mm -hmm. Yeah, kind of center it a little better because we are freezing it on that tray. Okay, okay. All right, so I'm still mixing up, Mom. Cool Whip center here. Make sure you scrape in the bottom, getting all that chocolate. There's a lot of chocolate in there. It's a little bit hard on your muscles because all those cookies, okay? All right, RJ wants to try a little bit. All right, you get to scoop in. We got quite a little mess here. So we're super excited about our new page. And everybody, we have like 120 people following us. Uh, you don't always have to come to the live shows. I know everybody's busy. It is Saturday, so you probably have a lot of things to do. Uh, so you could revisit the shows anytime you want. Uh, we've yeah, had a huge... Want you want to revisit this one, yeah. This is our first on our new page, Baking Buddies. So we are excited to have everybody to join us and watch the episodes. We've been getting a lot of feedback of people um, making the recipes that we put on there. So we really want to see that. So if you make this cake or if you made the pizza or if you made uh, one of the products, uh, put it on our page. Take a picture. Show us. Give us maybe some ideas or tricks that you changed about it, okay? So we want to see that on there. All right, how's it going? So we put these four on there. See them? And you, it's okay. You want to smash them together. You want them. If, if the cookie breaks, don't worry about it. You're not going to see that. All right, we're going to go ahead and start spreading. All right. doing too? So see that? All right, so we're going to put this chocolate mixture right on top. Whoop, we're sliding everywhere. We have that wax paper. And like I said, don't worry about it if it breaks, if the cookies break on there, on the top of the ice cream sandwiches, because you're not going to see that. What about the ice cream sandwich? That's what I mean, the oh, ice cream sandwich, oh. not the cookies. I'm sorry. How's it going, Liv? Good. So, Olivia, how old are you? Thirteen. Thirteen. 
Oh my goodness, 13. And she told me she also time. made the honor roll. So, and RJ did too, and so did Quentin. Everybody, all these people around me, the kids are so good. I'm so proud of you. Yeah. So the next we're gonna put another layer on. Okay. So you don't have to be gentle. You wanna smush it together because this is all gonna get molded, okay? You kinda are connecting the cakes. Push it, push it, push it. Got it? Oh, all right. Like <gasps> it doesn't look pretty while you're making it. It's when you cut it, okay? We'll show you a picture of that. And I want to mention, this cake is actually, we're not going to eat this cake. This cake is for Izzy. It's for her birthday. So she's going to eat this cake tomorrow. We made this cake for tomorrow. Anthony. Way to go. Hey. We made this cake for Anthony hey. for his birthday. So, there's Aunt Bertha. Hey, Aunt Bertha. Hi. <laughs> so we're working on this. All right. So we're putting that on there. You could, we could have put more. We still have more in this bowl. Um, I didn't put too much. There's a lot left over. So you don't have, it's up to you. If you want to fill it up and make each layer thicker, absolutely, you can do that. Are you going to add another layer? No, this is it right here. Okay. So this is our last layer. I'm so you push it on there. All right, so can you see it? Look at all that. Okay, so it doesn't look the best right now. All right, so we have our layers on there. And like I said, there's a lot more of the pudding mix. You can make the chocolate in between okay. layers thicker, okay? All right. <laughs> so now we want to coat it, okay? All right. I have this. You don't have to use that. You can use a knife. Oh, my gosh. And let me, I wanted to show you guys, too. If you don't have a food processor... There are other ways to chop up cookies. You can put them in a baggie and you can mash them with a glass. The important thing is, is to have like a thick cup. But I have, even if like maybe you ran out of baggies, put your cookies in a bowl, put them in the bottom, and you can mash them with the glass. And you kind of keep going and you mash them around. Yeah, until I get to eat them. You can play with it a little bit. Yay! <laughs> oh, he just wants to eat them. Yeah. So, we're going to ice the cake. So, you're just, there's no special science to it. We're just going to slop it on there, okay? We kind of want to work fast. Who wants to make this? Who wants to make this? Josh. Josh wants to make this? Yep. Oh, you totally should make this, Brooke. It's so easy. Oh, and you know what? $10 or less because this all this stuff is super cheap. I just got it at Walmart today. Nothing expensive. Okay, so we're going to do the sides. All right, RJ, can you move that over here? All right, here he comes with his cookies. We're just icing it up. Nothing special here. We do want to work quick, though. I can see the ice cream sandwiches are melting. Okay. They're melting. Once we put this in the freezer, it's going to go in the freezer for about two to three hours. So make sure you give yourself enough time uh, to put it in there. Oh no, it's got to be in there a long time. Okay? And I'm not dirty in another bowl. I'm just using the same bowl I got. The same, the same bowl. bowl I got. All right. How's it going over there, RJ? Good. Hanging out, huh? No jokes today. We just thought we would share with you the recipe. But I do love cake. Oh, but he does like cake and ice cream. So we're almost done with the cake. Super, ice super cream. easy. So if you guys make this cake, I want to see you post it on our page, okay? Send us a photo. Tag Baking Buddies in it, okay? We're almost done. Almost. We're getting there. Olivia, you really should be quiet. You're so loud. She's so quiet over there. She's always been I very, very quiet. It, I need it late. All right. If you made it to the show and you came in late, it's okay. I'm yeah. going to post this. Oh, hi. I'm going to post it and you can watch it from the beginning, okay? 
So $10 and you have this awesome cake, okay? All right, we're almost there. I'm just going around adding some more to make sure it's extra fluffy, okay? I mean, it doesn't hurt, right? We're almost there. Oh, Olivia, you got a lot of uh, viewers there. All right, how's it looking, guys? What do you mean? Like, we're doing, we're not doing anything. <laughs> he said, what do you mean? We're just watching. All right, you guys are going to work next. Okay, ready? Okay. All right, I'm, they got to work fast because we're, we're starting them out here. All right, guys, fast. I'll turn it over to you. All right, so let's see. Both of you hold your hands out. It's cookie time. Cookie time. Is it time for us to eat it? No, you're going to sprinkle those cookies all over that cake. Oh. <laughs> On the top. Now? Yep, go ahead. All around. Oh, I didn't Work together. Let Olivia put hers on, and then you put yours on. So there's no special process to it. It's just cookies. Sprinkle it all over. Got it? There's just chunky, chunky, chunky. Chunky, chunky. You know what? We'll put them all on there. Woo! Free! Don't eat that. I'm not. <laughs> I was just saving things. All right. There it is. All right. And then just for extra special, we're going to put a little syrup on it. When you're drizzling anything, you want to go higher. It's not going to be the cleanest thing ever. The higher it is, back and forth. The higher it is, back and forth. Ooh, look at that. All right. So we are finished with our ice cream cake. See? All right, let's show you the top. So it's going to go in the freezer for two to three hours. All right, and then you can slice it and eat it. RJ, can you show him the cake, what it looks like when you slice it? He's busy eating the cookies. Show him the picture, what it looks like when you slice it, because this is for someone's birthday. Got it? All right, zoom in and show them. All right, they're going to show you, okay? All right. It looks amazing. It tastes wonderful. Keep it there for a minute. We did post that picture on our page, too, so you guys would know. Uh, you just kind of slice it down here. I feel like it would feed about maybe 10 to 15 people. Um, we actually made this for Anthony's birthday, and um, oh, he's doing the zoom effect. We made this for Anthony's birthday, and about a week and a half later, it was still tasting good, okay? So it does last pretty long. Okay, that's good. So just to review, before we go, um, those are the ingredients. You guys can watch the video back again if you want, and freeze this for two to three hours before you serve it. Uh, thank you, Olivia, for being our guest today. And don't forget, if you like and share our page with all of your uh, friends and family, we still have a prize. Show them the prize. Olivia's right behind you. Olivia doesn't even know what it is. It's still here. We still have the prize. Like and share our page, Baking Buddies. Please share it. And then tomorrow, we're going to go live, and we're going to reveal the winner. Somebody's going to win the special prize. You don't know what it could be. It could be anything. All right. Put that back. And... I think that's it. Make sure you click the button to get notifications from Baking Buddies. And remember to share with your friends. Our next show will be something healthy. Um, we want to give a nice mix of really bad for you to really good for you. All right. Thanks for everybody tuning in. Ooh, and Ice cream and cake and cake. Ice cream and cake and cake. Ice cream and cake and cake. No, she said no.